you theme pro layouts with low dynamic content are fully collapsible. This means that layout parts with empty content collapse to prevent empty space. Let's take a look at my example page. In the top section, I added a WordPress widget and a WordPress area elements side by side. And in the second section, I have another area element in the sidebar. If widgets have no content output, the elements which load them collapse. They also collapse if widgets are not shown on a specific page. For example, the newsletter and the quote of the day widgets are only shown on this page. So, if we go to a different page, we can see that these widgets are not visible. This is why the widget element in the top section collapses. The layout collapses in a cascade, from smaller layout parts like elements and columns to bigger ones like rows and sections. That's why the left column in the top section collapses as well. The remaining column expands and takes the available space. Now let's go to my last page where all widgets are hidden. As you can see here, since both columns collapsed, the row and the section collapsed too. The following section moves up, so there is no empty space. The area element in the sidebar also collapses, so the remaining column with the grid takes the available space. Now you know how to create flexible builder layouts, which adapt according to the dynamic content.